which will be presented by Sinesia Little. Ladies and gentlemen, family, faculty, and my fellow classmates for the class of 2013, we are gathered here today to celebrate our new beginnings. Each and one of us has faced challenges with many more to come. Through all the challenges we have faced, we still managed to overcome our obstacles and to be here where we are today. It took me 13 years to graduate. I was very disappointed in myself because I was constantly making wrong choices. Choices that affected not only me, but my entire family. I want to take this time to apologize to my parents for all the pain I put them through. I know it wasn't easy, especially since I was their firstborn. I hope you forgive me for my mistakes. However, I would like to thank my family for sticking by my side and to turn me into this woman I am today. If it wasn't for my father, who always was always hard on me and stayed by the front door yelling in the back to make sure I was ready because he seen the bus on the way, I would have had too many absences. My mother constantly pushed me forward and encouraged me to do right by me and the choices I have made. Without their supportiveness and determination to help me seek what I need in life and what needs to be done, I really don't think I would have made it. So I'm standing here at this beautiful moment to say thank you for all that you have done. To my siblings, Kamaria and Asir, I don't say it often, but the love I have for you is timeless. And I beg you both not to make the bad decisions I have made. If anything, I will wish for you two to learn from my mistakes and most of all, follow your hearts. Secondly, I think my fellow classmates and I are very thankful that we transferred to Bannerman, surprisingly to say. Bannerman gave us another chance when no one else would, and I think you will all agree. Some are fortunate because their children could attend school with them as well. They were able to continue their education and set the right examples. And I'm very proud of them because in situ situations like that, times are hard. On this moment, we are filled with a great sense of happiness and accomplishment. I would like to wish all the seniors an extreme amount of luck in college and all your future decisions. When we walk out of this building today, never forget about the long line of wonderful teachers and staff at Bannerman Learning Center because I know they'll never forget you. And finally, to our admirable teachers, thank you for the time you've given us. You took the time to make sure we understood our lessons. You took the time to ex explain assignments, sometimes repeatedly because we weren't paying attention. You demanded excellence from us whether or not we wanted it for ourselves. You set the bar high and challenged challenge us to live it up. There have been plenty of times where you wanted to give up. However, teachers kept your heads high and pulled us through. You all showed us how much you really cared for us. You encouraged us to succeed and to get us where we are today. For this, we will be entirely grateful for your dedication. And Mr. Elliot and Ms. George, you're the absolute best. Some people could disagree on that, but I don't. You helped me and supported me so <laughs> You helped me and supported me so much when I stepped into Bannerman. Both of you have been instrumental in the trans transformation of this class. We have been inspired and educated. Class of 2013, keep your heads up to the sky for it is a limit. Thank you. Mr. Mike Elliott. This time I'd like to recognize two seniors who've embraced and taken advantage of the opportunities provided. This year's principal award goes to Elisa Pfeiffer, come on up, and to Nate Sinesia Little. Woo! Okay, hey, that's my little cousin right now. Yeah. <laughs> Michael McDonald. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> Hi, I'm 
just Tunisia and I just want to thank God for everything that he's done for me and my family and I would like to dedicate this rose to my family but this special rose go out for my mother.